Today's short focuses on the decision by the Bank of England to raise interest rates again. By a majority of five to four, the Monetary Policy Committee of the Bank of England has decided to raise interest rates to 2.25%. That's a 0.5% rise. Interest rates in the UK are now at their highest level in 14 years. And here's the chart showing what's happening to the base rate of interest. Of course, with interest rates lifting from their zero, effectively their zero floor, uh, as we've headed into 2022. Most economists think there's at least one interest rate rise left in 2022. Well, higher interest rates, of course, represents a tightening of monetary policy. Typically, it means more expensive mortgages. A £300,000 £300, mortgage will typically cost an extra £75 per month on the interest if you have a variable rate. It's potentially better good news for savers. They may get a more improved interest on their deposits, but many, many commercial banks won't necessarily pass on this rise in interest rates to their savers. There's a big gap still, huge gap, between the interest on savings and what's happening to inflation. Businesses may, may find their loan costs go up, their bank overdrafts and their bank loan costs increase. On the other hand, higher interest rates in the UK might help to retain some hot money in the banking system and perhaps stop the recent steep slide of the pound as it's depreciated against the US dollar. Well, the bank thinks the UK economy is already in a recession. And a lot of people are arguing, of course, on social media today that higher interest rates now, with room for more interest rate rises later on in 2022, risk making this recession deeper. But the bank, Bank of England, is worried that the government's tax cuts, their fiscal expansion, as part of their dash for growth, will cause increased inflation. And the bank is remaining committed to driving down inflation. Indeed, there were some committee members who voted for a 0.75 percentage rise in interest rates at a time when the Bank of England is of the view that we are in a downturn. Now, this seems slightly counterintuitive, obviously. So keep an eye out on what's happening to interest rates. It's one of the most important economic stories at the moment. Cheers now. Take care and see you soon.